Hey everybody, welcome to the Dano channel. I am Dano. I'm back in my little studio. I'm all frizzy haired. I just got out of the shower. Tomorrow we are leaving for Star Wars Celebration in Anaheim, so I gotta do a bunch of laundry tonight because I'm very last minute about things. Um, so I figured I would shower, get clean, get all my dirty clothes off of me. It's a nasty noise coming from somewhere. Um, but I wanted to share with you guys something. Cause I like sharing with you. It's fun. I, I like the the comments I got today on the uh, music one I posted yesterday, this morning. It was from yesterday, but I posted it kind of this morning. Oops, late. Um, but I like that some of you knew some of the music I was into, so that's really rad. That's cool to see. So, in that whole kind of idea, the same vein, if you will, I wanted to share with you guys my favorite YouTubers. Since here we are on YouTube, some of you guys are watching me do these Veda vlogs. We are day 14, almost halfway through the craziness that has been Veda, Vita, Veda, I don't know, Veda, how do you say, what, I don't know what the correct pronunciation, I'm going to go Veda, because there's no, nothing there to make the E sound long, I'm not a English major or anything, but on to the YouTubers, so I'm jumping into a, uh, whoa, 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 how does this work, click to record the full screen, I believe I am recording right now. How about now? Now I'm recording. So, first YouTuber you're going to see here on the screen, this is one of my favorites, my all-time favorites, Andre, Black Nerd Comedy. If you guys don't know much about Andre, please give his channel a look-see. It's under youtube.com slash user Black Nerd Comedy. He, this guy's huge. If you're a YouTuber and you're also another fellow Veda vlogger, um, if whenever you go to your like dashboard or whatever, main page, he's the he's there like all the time. He's on there. Uh, but he's hilarious. He's into the same kind of stuff I'm into. I just totally vibe with the guy. I'm like, oh, this is perfect. This is like exactly what I wanted to watch. Uh, and he got me into other couple other YouTubers like Lamar Wilson, uh, Katie Wilson, No Relation. You can see them down here on my screen over where my mouse is. Lamar and Katie right next to each other. Um, but yeah, Andre from Black Nerd is like seriously one of my favorites. Really one of my favorites. It's just amazing. Uh, which leads me to the next one. It's going to be Source Fed Nerd. I don't know if any of you guys have ever seen. There's a lot of nerd stuff, but you can tell by all the stickers and toys and weird stuff. But yeah, I'm into nerdy stuff. It's fun for me. I like it. It's good. It's fun. So, onto that, there is Source Fed Nerd, which has its own cast of characters. Today, unfortunately, they uh, was one of their cast last day. This girl, Trisha Hirschberger, who does like a lot of tech news. She does cosplay stuff, always goes to the conventions. Um... Really sweet on Table Talk. She's always like the really nice, sweet one. It was her last day today. It's like, oh, sad to see her go. Uh, but there's always new, funny, cool people they're always bringing in. They do a thing called Table Talk where they answer people's questions every week and talk for like 25 minutes about whatever they pull out of the bowl. And it's really funny. There's a guy named Steve Zaragoza who also cracks me up. And this guy is like me when there's not a camera on me is how he acts. Pretty much, very closely. But if for some reason, when the camera gets on me, I get in a slightly different way. It's the camera pressure pushing on my skull. Um, so I'm not quite there yet. I'm not super comfortable where I can just lash out and say whatever craziness comes to my head. There's a little bit of a slowing thought process. But Mr. Steve's... <laughs> Steve Zaragoza from SourceFed Nerd is... One of the people I aspire to be like as far as the freedom they have in speaking and just saying whatever they want. Because mine and that guy's humor are very, very, very similar. Uh, now i got to get on to the Disney stuff because you all know I'm big on Disney and all that good stuff. So one of my favorite Disney YouTubers, I've been watching her for years. She used to be on my stage. Uh, is Miss I'm Sarah Snitch. She is just amazing. I met her at the uh, All-Star Creator Conference. Um, spent actually a good amount of time hanging out with her and a couple other great YouTubers. Uh, I met her boyfriend, Leo Camacho, who's really nice. I got to hang out with him at Dapper Day, um, this last March 1st at Disneyland, which was really amazing and a lot of fun. So, overall, just, like, really cool people. She's always doing the coolest Disney stuff. Her and her boyfriend do the best Disney bounds. If you don't know what Disney bounding is, I'm not going to tell you. I'd rather you go learn from watching Sarah's channel because her and her boyfriend are, like, the best. No one can beat them as far as Disney bounding. They are just very fashion savvy. Both lovely, very nice, beautiful people. And they're really just cool, sweet people. Like, just seriously. Um, I love hanging out with them whenever I go down to Disneyland. I've hung out just the one time before. But 
we spent some time hanging out at the conference and it was really cool. Uh, I actually made her a pair of shoes. I might put a picture of it so you can see if you guys like uh, a Goofy movie. I blanked on what it was. Um, I made her a pair of shoes. So it's themed to the Goofy movies. You can see a picture of it somewhere on the screen, maybe. Uh, next up, another Disney YouTuber is this guy, Magic Journeys. Every Wednesday he's got a new video. Some of them are very, like, straightforward, like, documentary style. Some of them are just him wandering through the park with his girlfriend, Janelle. But this is Mig V. Another person I actually got to meet at Dapper Day. Uh, I was walking around, I spotted Adam the Woo, and I saw the guy next to him. I was like, oh, I recognize you, you're Mig V. And later on in the day, I got to hang out with Mig V and lovely Janelle. And I feel like I hit it off really well with them. I've been talking with them back and forth a couple times here and there in the last couple weeks. And I'm looking forward to meeting up with them this weekend during Star Wars Celebration. And possibly at Disneyland so we can go roam around, hang out, and have fun together. Um, but it's cool to know these other YouTubers. And those first ones on my list, Andre from Black Nerd, Steve Zaragoza from SourceFed, I'm coming for you guys. We are going to meet sometime in the next year, and hopefully it'll we'll hit it off and it'll be cool. Like, I've hit it off with a lot of these other people. Things have, you know, it's been nice. It's been cool to meet these other people that I watch on a screen normally and actually meet them. And, you know, it's neat to find that people are just people. Um, but Mick V was one of those awesome people that I really, really liked. So... I'm excited. Hopefully, we're going to be working on something together in the future. Um, if not, I'll always keep in touch, and whenever I go to Disneyland, I'll probably meet up with this guy if he's available. Another Disney person I mentioned him a minute ago, Adam the Woo. Join him, shall you? I watch a lot of Adam the Woo. Um, I got into Adam the Woo th kind of through the Live Fast, Die Poor thing. I got into Live Fast, Die Poor first. But I watch a lot of Adam the Woo, his daily vlogs, the Daily Woo. He's been doing it for 1,017 days now, straight, every day, a new daily vlog. And he has a main channel where he goes and visits, like, old filming locations or, like, just, like, weird, you know, movie locations, old abandoned theme parks. He got kicked out of Disney World for trespassing and getting cool footage for all of us to enjoy. So go to his main channel, Adam the Woo, look at all that cool urban exploring stuff. Uh, or just check out his Daily Woo videos, which are also really fun and interesting, too. Uh, and that's going to take me to my last one. I mentioned Live Fast, Die Poor. You can see right on here is Justin Scard. Not a very cool-looking background, but he's got his neat little fancy cartoon drawing of himself. And he does what's called the Sometimes Vlog. Uh, and his main channel, Live Fast, Die Poor, is a lot of Disney-related stuff. Um, but it's also like, you know, he goes to conventions as well. He goes traveling to cool spots like the El Capazon dinosaurs from Pee Wee Herman. Just neat, cool attractions that you don't normally get to see, that I personally would like to see or have been to. And you can watch him do really cool video on that stuff. And then here on his channel, Justin Scard, he does the Sometimes Vlog where him, Tyler Evans Rock Journalist, Adam the Woo, I believe McVee's maybe even been in one of these. They just hang out, ramble, talk, and I just, I feel, again, I met him at Dapper Day as well, so that's kind of cool. I get to hang out with him for a minute, too. Um, but these are people, I like their channels. Some of them I've met and liked them in person, which is even better. Um, but I just kind of wanted to share with you some of my favorite YouTubers. Now, I want to know from you guys, who are your favorite YouTubers? Don't all of you say me at once. Don't just calm down there. You can just, you can stop typing. I already know. I already know I'm on the list. Don't worry. It's cool. I got it. But, uh... You know, <laughs> you guys better say me. No, really, I'm just messing. Um, see, I like to do weird stuff like that. But yeah, leave it down below. I want to know who you guys watch. Who would you recommend that I watch if I didn't mention them already? Or you know someone that would be like, oh, dude, Dano, you'd probably dig this cool YouTube channel that I watch all the time. Check it out. I will definitely check them out. Um, so leave them down below. I want to know who I should be watching. Who are some of your favorite YouTubers? Leave it down there. Give the video a big thumbs up, just like the one above my thumb. See that sticker back there? I put it back there for subliminal reasons. So when I do my vlogs from way over here where my camera's set up, there's this little thumbs up right there in the background telling you, thumb up the video. Click that thumb. It helps get my video rated better so more new people get to see it. And then I'll usually throw up a big red subscribe button somewhere right around here for you guys to click. But I'm always really lazy about setting up the annotations, and it never works. So if there's another red button down there, how about you click that one? Because that one's probably going to work before this one works. Um, but the thumb always works. Hit the thumbs down there, too. I love you all.
Thank you so much for commenting. You guys have been really awesome through this whole VEDA thing, putting up with me, not doing my normal videos. Don't worry, they're coming. I've recorded them. I've just have been so busy with other stuff. I haven't had a chance to really edit, put them together, and get them out. But they are coming. I promise. They're coming. And I'm working on just like something else real quick before I go. I've been working on a tutorial on how I painted this because I want all of you to know all the steps I took to make this shoe happen. And I want to teach you guys how to do it. But it took like two hours. And I can't put two hours of video straight onto YouTube without people being like, I don't watch that. That's two hours long. So I got to cut it up into little bits where it's easy. And you guys can learn from me how to do cool things like that. Because that is what I want to do. I want to teach you guys how to do what I do. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all. I will see you tomorrow. Maybe from the road. Maybe I'll do a VEDA vlog on the way from Vegas to California. Let me know if you want to see it. I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye. I'm standing in Cinderella's shower. Stupid! Oh, awesome. That's so cool. But it's like.